Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. It's time for another plan with me and for my theme this April, I asked you to vote on our community board and the theme Ocean One. Thanks to everyone who voted and helped us pick a theme. Be sure to keep an eye out on our community board for special announcements, polls and things like that. Also, since this is a plan with me video, we will be hosting another giveaway at the end. So please make sure to look out for that and keep watching. And as usual, before we get started, here's a flip through of my March setup. I actually asked the community board as well to help me decide on a theme for this month. So thank you so much for voting. Alright, so for my cover page, I decided to do a quick little watercolour painting to get that watery ocean effect. So I'm starting with a quick fine liner sketch of a wave on a watercolour paper. And then I'm using the different blues from our Station Island 24 brush pens essential plus. And then I'm taking the large flat tip from our brand new Aqua Brush pack of six. I'm going to leave links to all of these products in the description box below for anyone interested, so don't forget to check that out. Right, so I'm just cutting that painting out and sticking that on the cover with a glue tape, then I'm just writing April next to the wave. As usual, I'm writing a quote on the left hand side of the spread, and the quote I chose for this month is For whatever we lose, like a you and a me, it's always ourselves we find in the sea. Which is a nice and fitting quote, and I just really like the Cummings poetry. So if you guys are interested in poetry, let me know your favourite poets in the comments below, I'd really love to check them out. Next I'm doing my monthly log and I'm just sticking to my favourite layout which is the calendar one. And then I'm just decorating the rest of the page with some ocean doodles and some bubbles, just to add a bit more life to my page. And I'm using a lot of blues for this theme because my last theme I used a lot of different colours. So I just wanted to do a more monochrome theme, but you can definitely do a more colourful one if that's your style and that's what you prefer. Okay, so next I'm just doing a mood tracker and for this one I'm just drawing a shell and dividing that into 30 sections, one for each day. I'm definitely not taking the credit for this, I just really like the design so I'm going to leave a link to my inspiration in the description box below. Alright so the next one is my habit tracker, for this one I'm just keeping it simple with a grid for each habit I want to track, then I'm just decorating the bottom of the page with some waves and then just a few little bubbles. My next page is for my little notes and memos throughout April and to stick to the theme I'm calling it message in a bottle. So for this I'm writing the title on the left side of the spread and then I'm taking the next page and drawing a wave and a message in a bottle on the left again. Then I'm just cutting the page out and then I'm using the glue tape to stick that page to the same page as the title. So we create a pocket and that's it. I'm really excited to use this page because I like having a space in my journal for all of my thoughts but I just don't want to use up a lot of pages in my bujo so a pocket is a great way to store all of that. On the right side of the spread I have a page for video ideas, it's pretty simple and straightforward. I'm just writing the title and then I'm drawing more waves at the bottom of the page to keep the theme consistent. And finally, I'm doing my weeklies, so for my first week, I'm just doing a standard weekly with 7 rectangles on a page and I'm just writing the numbers in a bubble.
Then I'm just decorating the little spaces at the top and bottom with some fish doodles. For my second week, I'm just dividing the page in half with a drawing of a rope with an anchor at the bottom and then I'm just writing the days of the week. And just before the flip through, I'm going to talk a bit more about the giveaway. We will be having three different winners and each winner will get to choose from three different prizes. The prizes are a bullet journal essentials kit that comes with either a black or a teal dotted notebook, a fine liner, a ruler, some stickers and index tabs. Or you could also get a pack of six aqua brushes with different nibs or a pack of glue tapes. To enter, all you have to do is subscribe to our channel, give this video a thumbs up and comment what theme you think I should do next month in the comment section down below. And finally, here's a flip through of all the pages I've set up for April. I hope you found this video helpful and if you did, please don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this and give this video a thumbs up, it really helps us out. Thank you so much for watching, see you next week!